Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with episode 41 of Skyrim. Alright, when we left off, uh, the game froze, but I had to clear the cache, and now I'm good here. We're just gonna watch this little thing here. You betrayed us! Best she know now, all right. Rogbear, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Tori. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't deserve to speak. There was no fighting. murder. Did you hear hey, some money? Someone put you to the uh, hell? What the hell's going on? What threw everyone into a fit? The the fuck? Why is everyone running? I mean, he got cut down over there instead of having his head chopped off. What the fuck? I have never seen this glitch. I'm not even sure if it's a glitch. I think it might just be a random encounter just spawned in the middle of the uh, execution phase. That would be vampires, but I'm not seeing them. Vampires are the only random ones to pop up in the middle of the city. Well, that, that arrow is from behind me. Um... The fuck? I've never seen that happen. You know you can afford a septum or two. I've never seen that happen. And he just disappears. The fuck just What? Okay. <laughs> I for a veteran. It's not much to ask. I don't know what to think. I don't know what to say. What, what's this going on here? Just a stare down? Why are you looking at me? You're supposed to be staring down him. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, now... What we were supposed to do was talk to Melbourne, but that whole thing kind of went to shit, and I meant to show you guys it. And, uh, okay. I'll just go on with the quest. Weird occurrences be damned. We'll keep going. That's a vampire attack. Why did it affect people there when there was no one nearby? Okay bunch of weird okay what do you need need to talk what? to you buddy our mutual friend sent me really you're who she picked I'm who she knows what she's doing I'm who the here's the deal dragonborn blood I picked, can I guess. some equipment <laughs> into the embassy for you don't plan on bringing anything else in with you the Thalmor takes security very seriously I'm sure. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Uh, I'm ready. Here's what I'll need. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Okay. Uh, I need to drop off my sword with him. That's what I meant to do, not do that. Uh, need that. I need all my armor, so I'm going to be running around naked. Throughout solitude, just wee. Uh, lockpicks. I always tend to forget them, so I'll hand him a couple lockpicks. They will be good for me. Uh, should I hand him my black star? I mean, I'm not gonna be needing it much. Yeah, just fuck it. Uh, some other potions. Uh, gonna give him all my poisons there. Uh. My healing ones, the fortified healths. Fuck. I pressed the wrong button. 
I thought I was going to be dropping all of them, like that one, so I pressed A instead. So I accidentally downed one I didn't need to. Fuck. Eh. Oh well. Uh. Couple stamina ones. Uh. Couple of those. Um. What else should I do? Maybe a couple of resist magics. Because I know there's got to be some magic users there. And maybe a potion of invisibility, or all of them, really. And I should be good. Yeah, I should be good. Well, that was from the health potion I took, which I wasn't supposed to. Now I'm buck-ass naked. <laughs> oh, boy. There we go. Let's get up. And wee I'm naked! Okay. <laughs> All right. Pick someone's pocket by activating them while sneaking. <laughs> Looking at their inventory is harmless. Taking anything is a crime. That the first sentence seems kind of clunky, but okay. Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll take care of the rest. Uh, word. Word use was a little weird there, but okay. I got that. Pretty much figured that. Fi Realized I said figured. Not what he said. I'm an idiot. <laughs> That's what that is right now. Are you kidding me? Oh boy. Game froze. Yay. God damn it. There we go. I fixed it now. It took me a reset, but I fixed it. I don't know why Solitude is giving me so much trouble. It's weird. Probably because I'm buck-ass naked. That probably has something to do with it. <laughs> anyway. we <clears throat> Got to talk to, uh... Delphine. Uh... Further down this way. Oh, geez. Ow. It hurt a little. It's not comfortable. Anyway. Talk to you. Have you given Malborn the gear you want Whoop. to smuggle into the embassy? Yes, Malborn's all set. Good. I have your invitation to the party. That was the quick. The only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means okay. you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Oh. Good. I can use the practice. What? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Without my armor, I'm completely deprived right now. God damn it. Jesus Christ. This is fan fucking tastic. Well, I can at least put on my clothing now. So that way I'm not completely naked. And it's just flying around doing nothing. This game is just full of things right now. Now that I think about it, this is probably what set off the guards. Although they weren't supposed to be set off by that. Hmm. Um. And I completely missed. It's not going to be anyone's. It's just flying around like a friggin' idiot. Okay, now it's over there. So they're sitting over here. God damn it. I missed. I need more practice with my spells. I have no magicka. Good thing I still have some on my potions. Not a lot of health ones. So, if I get hit, I'm kind of screwed. Okay, I do not have enough magicka for half the stuff I'm trying to do here. Um, draw an effect from magicka? That might help a little. Okay. I'm going to be trying my damnedest to be killing this with just fireballs, but 
spell wielders are very difficult to uh, wield when killing dragons. I'm just saying now. I'm not going to be uh, looking my best here. It's not normally what I do. Okay. If I had his weapon, I'd ha have a little more of a chance. Right now, I'm kind of surprised. Okay. Let's do... One more. There we go. Don't see that very often. That is unusual. Oh man, this is an action-packed episode. Now to absorb its soul. Hopefully Delphine keeps all this loot too. It's looting the dragon bones and dragon scales. I need them for things. She doesn't need them, I do. It came from the sky. Duh. Okay. Well, they're gonna sit there observing the little dragon. The little dead dragon. So. I'm just gonna go continue on my quest. Like a boss! I should not be saying that. That's Jacksepticeye's thing. Uh... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what to do for myself. Uh, okay. We've had this discussion nine million times with a million other guards. Shut the fuck up. All right. I do I look better? You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Rude. To board the carriage to the embassy. I'm ready. Keep the rest of my things safe for me. Don't worry. It will all be waiting for you when you get back. It better be. Just I got some dragon bones here. Get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. I guess that will have to do. You there we go. Why are you repeating your dialogue? Okay, there we go. Wee! The thief stone ability lets you learn stealth skills more quickly. Now that I think about it, that's probably why the game crashed as well. The whole dragon thing. Because it was so unusual, the game couldn't handle it. It's like, what? Uh, anyway. A fellow latecomer to Ellenwyn's little soiree. Yeah. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, sir. Mm. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this God's forsaken mountain than to any desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early, often the day before the party, so as not to miss out on any of the drinking. You can blame you. <laughs> I would do the same thing. <laughs> Perfectly honest here. To the Thalmor what? Oh. Your invitation, please. Is there a problem? Of course not. Purely a formality. Now, I need to see your invitation. Here you go. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Yeah, you better say yes, Here's sir. Motherfucker. Oh, hey there. Are advised to remain inside the embassy. Yes, ma'am. Razalan. That's a guy you like. That's a guy I can get behind right there. Man of my own heart. I guess. <laughs> All right, now it's time for it to load a little bit. There we go. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Ellenwyn, the Thalmor ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? Uh, my name is Tyrong. Pleased to meet you. Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, tell me more about yourself. What brings you to this... to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? It's oh, that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do mm -hmm. I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. Well, my apologies. It's a little annoying, huh? Better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. 
Oh, I will. Why, man? Yay! What can I get? Talk for to you. you. What can I get for you, sir? Hey, buddy. I'd like a drink. There you go, sir. The finest Colovian brandy. Is there More anything beans. else I can get for you? I'm ready. Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. Prove that he's the equal of Ireland Greymane. Not really a fair comparison, if you ask me. <clears throat> After all, Ireland works the Skyforge. How is any smith going to compete with that? Huh. Is my star seen to your needs? Very much so, and thank you for asking. Excellent. Mm, what's a fit way to cause a distraction? Let's talk to our buddy over here. What is talk to Razzalon. What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? Simply need to ask me, my friend. I brought you a drink. Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles. <laughs> if there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Actually, there is something you can do for me. Wonderful. I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. I need you to cause a scene. Get everyone's attention for a few minutes. Is that all? <laughs> My friend, you've come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. <laughs> Stand back and behold my handiwork. Oh, I will. I gotta watch this. Attention, everyone. Could I have your attention, please? I have an announcement to make. I propose a toast to Ellen Wynn, our yes, mistress. What are you I doing? speak figuratively. Uh, Nothing could be more unlikely than that someone would actually want her in their bed. Oh, jeez. Although, most <laughs> of you are already in bed with her. But again, I speak figuratively, of course. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Before anyone notices us. <laughs> Wouldn't want to offend our Thalmor overlords, would we? <laughs> Bring me a drink, quick. <laughs> that is the best. All right, I'll take that. Oh. Ow! Ow! No! Oops! Oh dear! God! Okay, that's enough of that. I'm being a dork. Uh, I'm just gonna loot some of these for food stuffs later. You know why not? Let's go, Malborn. Be quick. Hello, sister. Who oh, I know. Okay. Stay close and let me do any talking. Got it? Follow me. Who comes, Malburn? You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. Well, this is one you should recognize, sister. A guest in the kitchens? You know the Ooh, leaks. I need those. Rules. rules, is it, Savai? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar. I could use those. Get out of here. Get out of here. I saw nothing. There we go. There's in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Oh, I'll try not to. I'll loot all of the food stuffs first. Oh, shush up. I know. There we go. Cool beans. Now I just need to equip all of it. That, that, that. Dump that. Oh, I can't dump it because it's quest item. Okay. But I can equip the rest of my stuff. Uh, yeah, I got basically everything I need. Cool. All right. Time to... Uh, ooh, more leaks first. And... Okay, okay, geez. All right. And I'll sneak away a bit. Did you see those robes march in this morning? Okay. Who are they with? More of the emissaries' treaty enforcers? No, they're high mages, just in from Alinor. I guess herself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. <laughs> ah, good. I've been wondering how we were supposed to defend this place from a dragon. If a dragon does show up, maybe we'll get lucky, and it will 
will eat the mages first. Might give us enough time to kill it. Ha! I'd like to see those arrogant bastards taken down a notch. Always looking down their noses at us lowly foot sloggers. <laughs> so there's elitism even within the uh, Thalmor, huh? That's... That's nice to know. I'll let them move on a bit. And I'll keep going this way. Ooh, Thalmor robes. I can use those and those and those. The boots and gloves mainly because they look decorative. Um... Someone saw me. Or detected the sound of me, anyway. Yep, yep, they're still detecting the sound of me. Uh, light feet. I could use that. Uh, how long does it last? 60 seconds. Uh, pfft. yeah, sure, why not? Alright. Move on a little bit. You're Fuck. Some, so much use for that potion. And chop you down. And... Whoops. Complete whiff. And fucking fantastic. Uh, someone's coming this way. Maybe that's upstairs. It's probably upstairs now that I think about it. Oh, the light armor ones, huh? Eh. The light armor versions are crap. Don't really sell well. Oh, I'll take that. The helmet does have some value, but other than that, it's pretty much useless for the whole thing. Uh, take that. I'm a cat, thank you very much, bitch. Well, uh, I can save and then face you later. Because this is the end of the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And, you know, share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. And we can talk about the games that we're currently playing. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat. Playing games for you.